Welcome back to Houston Life. If you've never heard the phrase so fetch, then you definitely cannot sit with us. No, no, I'm just kidding. But the 2004 classic Mean Girls gave us some of the most quotable lines of all time. And now that film has been turned into a Broadway musical. One of your favorite. Movies, I've seen right? it. It's fantastic. It is so good. Add in the plastics, the burn book and some original tunes. And you've got a show that's really gruel. Lauren Kelly got a <laughs> chance to chat with two local actresses who star in the production. Well, just like you always say, Courtney, there is always a Houston connection. And one of our favorite films of all time, Mean Girls, has been transformed into a Broadway, Broadway musical. And we're chatting with two local stars who are in the show today. This is Jasmine and Asia. We are so excited, ladies. <laughs> we are too. We are too. Yes. So, all right, let's just jump right into it. Jasmine, you play Gretchen Wieners. This is an iconic role. What was your first reaction once you landed? Landed it. I was ecstatic. I literally found out on the train on the way to another job I was working on, and the the cut, like the um, service cut out. Uh, while I was talking to my agents on the phone, <laughs> so when I finally got them back, it was um, I was just so shocked. Honestly, it was it was an amazing experience to find out. No, your response was, "Oh my God, that is so fetch! I can't <laughs> believe it!" Right? Yes, absolutely, for sure. <laughs> yes. So you guys are both from Houston. What part did you did you grow up in? I grew up in Richmond, Sugarland. All right, and Asia, you're part of the ensemble. What part did you grow up in? I grew up in Houston, Texas. So you're right here in the H town, right in the middle. So this is kind of a quick run for Mean Girls. You're here through Saturday, uh, through Sunday, excuse me, the 21st. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about the show? Is it straight up like the movie? A lot of references, like the Easter eggs. What are we gonna see? Yeah. So in 2004, it's a little updated version since then. So it's a very like 2022 updated version with a lot of social media. Um, uh, involved and things like that. So it's like more of like cyberbullying because you bring the 2022 aspect in. Yeah. And a lot more secrets because your hair is so big. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, so I have new wigs, so you'll have to come check those out. Mm -hmm. They're really, really awesome. What do you think is going to be our viewers' most favorite part? I mean, there's so many iconic lines in the in the film. I know there's going to be so many more in, in this live for show. Sure. For sure. Uh, I don't know which one would be... I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you'll we'll have to come see it. <laughs> yeah, you'll have to come see it. I think I think you guys will love uh, the take on Karen that the musical has. I think she has a lot of really great, great stuff to do. Mm -hmm. So that'll be really cool to come see. Mm -hmm. I'm excited to see if she does any kind of meteorologist work in this show. You, you know what we're talking about, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's talk a little bit more about, about Houston. Did you always grow up wanting to do theater and musical performances and stuff like that, Asia? Oh, for sure. Um, so my dad actually put me into musical theater since. I was three years old, so I've been in it ever since then. And so, yeah, I did it in college, and now I'm here. So. And now you're here. Jasmine, what about you? Same. Um, I started off dancing when I was around two, and then I started musical theater around seven, and then I've been doing it ever since. So, yeah. I think a fun fact I read about you, Jasmine, you didn't originally, uh, you originally auditioned for Regina. I did. I did. I originally, well, I originally auditioned for both of the girls, um, and I had, there was a lot of back and forth through that, and toward the end, and eventually when I was cast, I was just in for Gretchen, and then I landed Gretchen, so. Well, no offense, <laughs> but you're, like, really pretty. Oh. And <laughs> Thank you, thank you. I think you landed a perfect role. Thank you very much. Well, where can people grab tickets to the show, ladies? Um, they can grab tickets at the Mean Girls website. All right. Yeah. I also know that hobbycenter.org yeah. as well. We're so excited. Thank you so much for sharing a little bit behind the scenes. What's your favorite costume? Ooh, I think I wear a troll doll costume. It has like a troll doll and then a troll doll skirt. <laughs> it has like the hair on it. So it's, it's during Fearless. So okay. I love that one. Jasmine, what about you? It had the hair on it. That is so cute. <laughs> I would say my favorite costume would probably have to be. I think right now it is my act two opener costume because it's really chaotic and it has a lot of pineapples on it and it's it's a great time. All right. <laughs> I, I wore my pink and I wore my gold hoops for you, Gretchen. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Oh my goodness. Thank you, ladies, again. And have a great show tonight. Break a leg. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Of course. Definitely a show that you guys are going to have to go see. Derek and Courtney, back to you guys in the studio.
All right, Lauren Kelly, very nice. I'm not a regular mom. I'm a cool mom. Cool it's, mom. it's true. It's one of the most quoted films. And one of the most interesting parts about this production, their set is totally digital. Right, so which, there's no nobody actually moving the pieces, right? There are some moving pieces like, you know, props, desks, furniture like that. But the entire backdrop is digital. And so they can go from inside the school to home to outside the school in a snap. Literally, it is worth seeing. You'll be glad you did. It is so awesome. And the costumes are so great as well. If you would like to catch Mean Girls the musical at Hobby Center, we do have a link to purchase tickets on our website. That's HoustonLife.tv. All right, come